One of the questions I get all the time is, is silicone safe? And all of us have silicone in us. If you've ever had a shot or a vaccination, you have silicone in you. It's the lubricant for all of our needles. It's in antiperspirants, it's in shampoos, makeup, mascara, and silicone in these products can be absorbed through the skin. So practically all of us are exposed to silicone and there are really no known health uh, effects of having silicone implants in you. One of the first charges that, uh, that came about with silicone implants is that they were causing breast cancer. And we've done multiple studies, multiple and international studies that have indicated that there's no increase and the risk for cancer if you have a silicone implant. Some of the studies are actually showing that you're at a lower risk. The next thing that the controversy moved into was autoimmune disease. Examples would be scleroderma, lupus, rheumatoid arthritis, those types of things. But there's again no good data supporting that notion that silicone implants are are creating a higher risk for you. So as far as I can tell you there's no systemic issue with a silicone implant.